As night slowly turns to day, another shift begins at Fire Station 10. But these are not your average firemen. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> women firefighters are still scarce. An all-women crew is something you almost never see. But don't tell that to Karen Lemming, Jenny Gunnell, and Gail Nicolaison. The they staff an all-day, all-night shift at Tacoma's busiest fire station, where making it not only meant convincing the men. There's always resistance. Karen and Gail don't have to worry about what their husbands think. They both ended up marrying Tacoma firemen. They understand the stresses that we have. They understand when I come home and all I want to do is sleep until 3 o'clock in the, in the afternoon. They just have a better understanding of what we go through every day, right. as we do of them. But perhaps the biggest challenge came in convincing the public. What sort of comments do you get when you get out there? When people find out it's an all-woman crew. We do get a few jaws dropped. We have women that call and they need help getting up, and we've gone in. Okay, you know, are you hurt? And like, no, but I was. A, I need two or three big firemen to help lift me up. <laughs> you know, I was like, hey, uh, here we are. You gotta <laughs> basically go and jump park out. A man suffering from emphysema is gasping for breath. His wife calls 911. Engine 10 responds. Day and night, we eat together, we sleep in the same place, we get up in the middle of the night together. This is my, my second family. You know, it's challenging, it's physical, it's spiritual, it's emotional, it's a lot of different things. But firefighters also have camaraderie. That camaraderie shows at this holiday lunch, honoring the men and women of the Tacoma Fire Department. You're doing an awesome job. Less than 20 years ago, Eileen Lewis became Tacoma's first female firefighter. Now, she's the fire chief. Tacoma now has 36 uniformed female firefighters, out of 402 total. If 9% seems low, check this out. New York City has 38 women out of over 11,000 firefighters. There are a lot of departments across the country Absolutely. that haven't opened up to women. They need to get out of the Stone Age and realize that everyone has an opportunity. They've done a very good job with, with all of the service that they provide to, to our community. And the women say they bring something else to the job. We're sensitive people and we're not afraid to shed a few tears. 